Hey, Smile Child. Welcome back to another video. Look, I, I just want to get up here and tell y'all, when it comes to natural hair and humidity, and I know I look tired, y'all. They don't work me this week. I am tired. I'm actually about to go into this, uh, my little massage place and get my feet rubbed on because my dolls are aching. I am so tired, but I want to get this video out because... One of my friends just messaged me, and she's mad with her natural hair. She had a conference to go to in Florida. Okay, now we stay in North Carolina, so she had a conference to go to in Florida. Mm. Let me drink some water. I feel like I had something in my teeth, like some lettuce. I just ate a wrap, a grilled chicken wrap. It was good too. It was good. It be this little place they be coming by the um this little business. Well, I don't want to call them little business. They're a big business, big, big small business. Uh, Cookie Crumble send me a check. I always be put my my clients on them. Uh, sat they come by and they sell salads and wraps and they be having cookies and stuff. It be good. If you want my clients and you and you be coming to me, you already know who I'm talking about. If not, uh, y'all go ahead and hit them up, support them, Cookie Crumble. When they come through with the come through in the salon. So could Crumble send me a check because I done put a lot of people on to y'all salads and wraps, okay? But that's besides the point. But anyway, she was texting me because she is in Florida for a conference and she uh got a, a weave done and she got some uh some leave out and she's a hundred percent natural. And she said, I'm mad at this natural hair. Saying um, I'm over it. I said, look, baby girl, don't be made of the natural hair. You in Florida, baby. You in Florida. Okay? Florida, look, it's hot in North Carolina today. It's My car says it's 81 degrees. Okay? We having this a nice day. So, I, I, I'm not sure what the weather is in Florida right now. But all I know is Florida can be humid. And so, I'm making this video to explain to, to the ladies. When it comes to natural hair and humidity... And you're trying to wear a silk press, you not your natural hair is not gonna win. And let me just add this other layer. If you're the type of person that you don't get silk presses on the regular either, you might get a silk press once or twice a year. Girl, if you go somewhere that's real human, that silk press, you can forget it. Like it's you, you, your natural hair is gonna lose. It's gonna revert. Okay, it's gonna start reverting back, it's gonna start looking puffy. So I'm making this video as a public service announcement that. We have to, and I'm going to say this before, but I'm going to repeat it. We have to keep in mind that, and then this young lady right here got her nice little style, and I, I should flip the camera around and show it, but I want to put people on, on the camera because she ain't asked me on my YouTube channel, and y'all might know her, but her hair look nice and good. She got it nice and slick back. There you go, lady. But so what we have to remember our lifestyles and even where we travel okay so say you go on a vacation or you say like my friend you're going to a conference you have to consider the weather if you have natural hair okay it's a thing that's why you see a lot of black a black a lot of uh africa us african americans then when we go on vacation honey we get us some braids because we might be worried about this hair okay we want to get in the pool and swim and do this and that so we have to take that into consideration because a lot of times I see people who only get blowouts once or twice a year and then they be like, oh, but I work out five days a week and I sweat a lot in my hair. Now, I'm not telling you not to work out, okay, because I don't want your hair to be a reason why you're not working out. But just know that when you go to work out, them roots are going to curl back up. If you sweat like your them roots going to curl back up. So don't think you can get you a blowout and you can go work out every day and you're hundred percent natural. You can go work out every day and the roots ain't gonna curl up. Now I have to say this because it's been so many times that, you know, women come to me and they be frustrated with their natural hair. And it's, I don't want y'all to be frustrated. I don't want y'all to be angry with your natural hair. You have to pick and choose things, choose styles that's going to work with whatever activity you have coming up, whatever kind of, uh, you know what's your lifestyle like okay so and you know i some people silk practices last a little bit longer than others and it could be because of their lifestyle and it could be because their hair is you is is heat trained it's just used to being flat on and being straight all the time but if you if you're that type of person and you don't get blowouts like that and you out here doing some extraneous activity or you go somewhere you go on vacation 
and it's raining and you got the humidity that that blowout that uh that uh weather gonna be like what blowout what silk press because the humidity is here okay so we have to keep that in mind we have to keep that in mind and i know y'all want to wear the weaves and stuff like that the naturals y'all want to wear the weave with the which y'all y'all want to have the leave out right here and see what happens is y'all be getting these weaves that's with straight hair or quick weaves with straight hair that's fine but then you want to have a leave out okay and your leaf out ain't heat train or ain't used to be flat on a lot so what happens is you got welcome to wakanda right here and then you got brazilian wavy down here like let's stop fighting it just just go ahead and get something that's close to your natural curl type or just know that if you get to sweating or get in the human area human uh weather that natural that's the leaf out is gonna curl back up so you got two options Okay, you want to get the leave? Maybe you need to get your lace closure. Maybe you need to get your full, you know, sew in a full quick weave when none of your natural hair is out. Okay, so we have to make sure we're taking all these things into consideration. And don't get mad at the hair. You can't get mad at your hair. I mean, this is what God gave us, you know. But we just have to learn how to work it and 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 take our life. That's the key. Take your lifestyle into consideration. When you get in these styles, take your lifestyle into consideration. If you some somebody, and I just had a client earlier today, she like, you know, I love my natural hair, but I don't like the hassle of, you know, having to do this and this and that. And I'm like, okay, so you the type of person that need to be in my chair every two weeks, or you need to get you a style that's going to like a crochet or something that's going to last you a while. So you don't have to really deal with it. Okay. So if you know you're the type of person you like to deal with it, you might, and you don't know how to do your hair. That's an investment for you. And you want your hair to look good. That means you might be one of those clients and not need to be up in somebody's chair every two weeks. Okay. So, you know, just make it make sense for y'all, for you. So y'all, my appointment, I got my appointment is 3.15, it's 3.13, honey. I'm about to go in here, honey. I'm going to wear my mask because, honey, I'm about to, I'm about to fall asleep. They about to put me slam asleep. I mean... Last time I was slobbering, and I said, you know what, I thank God for these masks because, child, I woke up, the inside of my, my mask was moist. <laughs> inside of my mask was moist. I'm about to go ahead and pass out because I earned this foot massage, and it's, it's about to speak to me. So, y'all have a beautiful Saturday. I'm about to start my own wine. I know I'm looking tired in my eyes, but it's okay. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. And look, if you're struggling with your natural hair and, and you, you don't want to feel frustrated about your natural hair, you want, you want, you, Lisa, you like, Lisa, can you help me out? Well, look, go on my, click the link in the description box and book a one-on-one -on -one hair coaching session. And I can help coach you through your natural hair so you don't have to feel frustrated so I can make your life easier. I can, you can buy back your time of having to deal with your natural hair okay so you can click the link in the description box and also today is the 15th of october so if you're watching this video that means that um my november calendar is now open um yeah today it opened at 12 today so if you are a new client or a current client and you want to book a hair appointment make sure you go and book it i have two saturdays that i'm working in november may the odds be forever your favor i'm not sure how many slots are left but try to grab what you can. And I'm working some extended hours the week of Thanksgiving. Then on Kawanda. Look at Kawanda. Look at Kawanda. <laughs> Kawanda about to get her toes rubbed on. I'm about to tell him, like, girl, you better come here and get your toes rubbed on. Y'all, that's my coworker. That's my coworker. We over here at the his little foot massage place. I'm like, she better come get her feet rubbed on, honey. After we be slaving these heads, all that jesus okay all right y'all i'm seeing characters now so let me get ready to go y'all have a blessed day